What's up guys, this is Kim from Einfach Machen. On this channel we share our daily experience with the Power Platform and want to give you some straightforward solutions and tips for easy to intermediate problems. <laughs> In today's video, I'd like to share with you a quite simple flow you can use to send, in this example, a recurring mail when uh, someone in your company, for example, has his birthday. And um, using two different ways to send this flow, let's have a look on the first one. It's called Send Happy Birthday Using SharePoint. And uh, what I mean with using SharePoint is that basically, in this case, SharePoint is my data source. So the first step of this flow is this flow has a recurrence. It runs every day at 6 a.m. So it's a recurring flow. You don't have to do anything to trigger this flow. It automatically runs every day. And uh, the next action is that we get all our items from our table employee data. This is the table where we have our employee name, um, our employee email address and also our employee birthday date. So we just get all items out of the employee data table and after that we use uh, for each or uh, apply on each loop because for each of these rows in our employee data we are uh, composing the birthday date, which uh, column name is the date of birth. And after that, we have our if condition. So um, we, in this case, because we don't want to compare the whole date, we only want to compare the month and the day. So if the birthday variable, this one, is equal to UTC now, so today basically without the year, then we are sending an email to, in this example, my email address with a subject. Today we say celebrate the birthday of, and this is the dynamic name. It depends on whose birthday is today. And uh, here we have some HTML text and uh, a little if we put in this email. So let's have a look on how this one runs. Test the flow. And as you can see, nice, today's my birthday. So that's version number one. The second version to, in this case, send a happy birthday email is uh, using office groups. And I think uh, this is also an interesting way because you can use, again, the first step is the same like in our SharePoint data source. The flow runs every day on uh, 6 a.m. After that, we list all our group members. And to list all our group members, we have to select a group ID. In our case, this is a group where all employees are in, all, all user accounts in our company um, are in this group. So after that, again, we have these apply to each loop. So for each group member in our group Alle Mitarbeiter, we are getting the user profile using the UPN, the user principal name, which uh, is basically formatted as an email address. And then again, we have our if condition, if the birthday with month, month minus day, day is equal to today, then we want to send an email. So it's a quite simple flow. In this case, for our birthday flow, um, we can use this office group flow, but if you have other use cases like, for example, send me an email if someone gets a salary increase or if you're using it for, for example, a fleet management, if my car has to has to have an inspection, and then you also can send a flow based on a specific date which you can 
look up in your data source. So I hope this one might help you sending nice birthday emails to your colleagues. And uh, if you liked it, hit the subscribe button and leave a comment. Thank you guys.